Breaking down Arizona, Nevada midterm races as vote count continues. Fox News Decision Desk's Darren Shaw gives the latest outlook on razor-thin margins in the remaining Arizona and Nevada races on your world. Nevada Democrat U.S. Sen. Catherine Cortez Masto is inching closer to overtaking the lead that Republican Adam Laxalt has. Following the latest updates from Clark County, Laxalt's lead over Cortez Masto shrunk to 798 votes after the county tallied 27,229 votes, resulting in a pickup of 8,190 votes for the incumbent senator. Clark County is Nevada's most populous county, with roughly 2.29 million people. In the race for governor, Republican Joe Lombardo has unseated Democratic incumbent Steve Sisolak, the Fox News Decision Desk Kin Project. Nevada's Clark County has more than 50,000 ballots left to count, expecting bulk to be tallied by Saturday. U.S. Sen. Catherine Cortez Masto, DNV, speaks at an election night party hosted by Nevada Democratic Victory at the Encore on November 8, 2022, in Las Vegas. Nevada. Supporters and candidates gathered to await the results for several key races in the state of Nevada including the gubernatorial and Senate race. U.S. Sen. Catherine Cortez Masto, DNV, speaks at an election night party hosted by Nevada Democratic Victory at the Encore on November 8, 2022, in Las Vegas, Nevada. Supporters and candidates gathered to await the results for several key races in the state of Nevada including the gubernatorial and Senate race. Anna Moneymaker slash Getty Images Lombardo is the only Republican to flip a governor's seat this election cycle. In Clark County, the deadline for all ballots to be counted is Tuesday. Nevada Senate race, Laxalt lead over Cortez Masto shrinks after latest vote count update. Adam Laxalt speaks to a crowd at an election night event on June 14, 2022 in Reno, Nevada. The Nevada primary is attracting national attention as Republican Senate candidates prepare to challenge incumbent U.S. Sen. Catherine Cortez Masto, DNV, in November. Adam Laxalt speaks to a crowd at an election night event on June 14, 2022 in Reno, Nevada. The Nevada primary is attracting national attention as Republican Senate candidates prepare to challenge incumbent U.S. Sen. Catherine Cortez Masto, DNV, in November. Photo by Trevor Bigzon slash Getty Images. Clark County Registrar of Voters Joe Gloria said during a Friday press conference that they are reaching the tail end of what we need to do. Democrat Nevada Gov. Steve Sisolak who faces a tough re-election bout against Clark County Sheriff Joe Lombardo. AP photo slash John Locker. Washoe County, the state's second largest county, still has about 23,000 ballots left to count, according to the Las Vegas Review-Journal.